Okay, uh, Assalamu alaikum boys. Uh, today our topic, uh, the new tense, uh, will be future perfect tense. Now, future and perfect things. For this tense is used to show an a event or action that will have completed in the future. Any essa event, essa vakya, jo future may complete ho chuka hoga. And the basic thing that you will have to remember is the use of shall have and will have. Now, the use of shall and will is the same as we have been uh, studying in future tense uh, where it is used, you have been explained very well. And after shall have and will have, we use third form of the verb. Is it clear? Shall have, will have, third form of the verb. Now again and again you will realize that forms of verbs are important and I keep on telling you please uh, learn them, learn them. You have a lot of uh, we have done uh, on this uh, board a lot of forms of verbs and uh, they must be remembered. For example, I've written an example here the train will have arrived at the station. It's not present, it's not past, it is something in the future. Something will have happened in the future. You are sitting at your place, at your home, uh, you look at your watch and that is the time when the train arrives, the station, and you can say the train will have arrived at the station. Pir, in the next example, you, you say that we shall have taken tea. Tea ke hum chai pi chuke honge aap kehte hain 5 baje ka time hai aur aap kehte hain ji hum to 4 baje chai pi chukte hain theek hai aap wahan par istemal karenge there you will use that we shall have taken tea aur negative iska jo hoga wo si tarah se shall aur will ke baad not lagana hai we shall not have taken tea. The doctor will have examined the patients. You have uh, taken a patient there and he has, doctor has given you some time and you say that by now the doctor will have examined the patients. Right? Or negative banane ke liye, the doctor will not have examined the patients. Right? Or iska interrogative, iska question banate waqt, shall or will, pehle a jayenge. Will the doctor have examined the patients? The policeman will have caught the thief. यानी कि आप पुलिस का आदमी एक चोर के पीछे गया हुआ है और आप कहते हैं कि इस वक्त तक पुलिस वाले को चोर को पकड़ लेना चाहिए ठीक है द पुलिस मैन विल हैव कॉट द थीफ द पुलिस मैन विल नॉट हैव देखिए विल के बाद नॉट आ रहा है विल नॉट हैव कॉट द थीफ or question kaise bana hai? Will the policeman have caught the thieves? 
I shall have reached Karachi by August 2nd. Yeah, 2nd August. Jani ki mein 2 August tak Karachi pohunch chuka hunga. Na ye past hai, na ye present hai. A future ka ek event bata rahe hain ki mein ye kaam kar chuka hunga. Future perfect hai. ठीक है परफेक्ट हम इसलिए कह रहे हैं कि वो काम कंप्लीट हो चुका होगा ठीक है टू शो एन एक्शन दैट विल हैव कंप्लीटेड इन द फ्यूचर दिस इज व्हाट द फ्यूचर परफेक्ट टेंस इज वी आर कमिंग वेरी क्लोज टू फिनिश दीज टेंसेस बिकॉज बॉयज दीज आर basic things wherever until the end of your life these tenses will be used if you are good at tenses you are good at english so these are minor things shall have will have third form shall not have or shall have in questions and negative so these are very simple examples of uh, future perfect tense uh, we can do some practice in translation as well because in examinations all over wherever you will go they will ask you some translations right now we'll do a bit of practice on urdu translation and uh, that will make you perfect सेंटेंस इज जमीन सो चुका होगा ठीक है फ्यूचर आपको पता है कि वो जो है दस बजे साढ़े दस बजे सो जाता है उस वक्त ग्यारह बज रहे हैं तो आप कहते हैं कि जमीन सो चुका होगा देखो इसको फॉलो करना है बेटे जमील Shabash will have gone third form to sleep. ठीक है जमील will have gone to sleep. चान निकल आया होगा शाबश बेटे द मून मून नहीं हेवनली बॉडीज के साथ हम द लगाते हैं द मून विल हैव निकलने का क्या बताया था आपको राइज राइज रोज रिजन द मून 
will have risen. Next is Suraj Gurub Ho Chuka Hoga. Phir heavenly body hai, sun nahi aayega, the sun. The sun will have set set ki three tino form set ye bete set 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 a nahi उन्होंने टिकट खरीद लिए होंगे। दे विल हैव बॉट tickets हमने कपड़े तब्दील कर लिए होंगे। We shall have changed our Clothes. We shall have changed our clothes. Ahmed ne ye khabar sun li hogi. Ahmed ne ye khabar sun li hogi. Ahmed will have heard this news. Ahmed will have heard this news.
रफीक ने सच बोल दिया होगा रफीक विल हैव Rafiq will have spoken the truth. Bete, aapko pehle bhi bataya hua hai to speak the truth, theek hai? And to tell a lie. Jhoot bolna, wahan pe speaking nahi istemal karenge. Jhoot bolna to tell a lie aur sach bolna to speak the truth. फैसल इम्तिहान दे चुका होगा फैसल विल हैव टेकन Faisal will have taken the examination. Given नहीं है अच्छा बेटे Given the examination नहीं इम्तिहान देना give नहीं No. Take the examination. Take the test. ठीक है Faisal will have taken the examination. So oh, we'll stop here. And your homework is to write these sentences and turn them into negative and turn them into interrogative that is your homework uh, you practice it and uh, inshallah next time we'll start the last tense uh, future perfect continuous tense okay beta uh, uh, Khudafiz and take care.